what's up you guys Alfie Terry Axia and today I'm going to be reacting to some more of the hundred this is season 7 episode 12 um something else that I forgot to mention at the end of last episode is I w think I would have liked like so like clearly that end scene was kind of just to create like some kind of interaction between a lot of them before the reveal of Bellamy being alive to them okay I think I would have preferred to have seen them all like kind of upset about Diosa's death. Um, I mean, Clark wasn't all that keen on her, I guess, but, like, Octavia really, um, developed a bond with her, so I feel like we should have really had some kind of, I don't know, discussion there, uh, about, you know, the previous episode's, um, death. Also, notice that Hope wasn't there either. I don't know. I think that was just missing. Anyways, let's get into the episode. Convicts, children of Gabriel. Welcome to the new sanctum. Things have changed quickly, but the future is full of promise. And to reap the benefits of this bright new day, I ask only that you take a knee. A simple gesture that binds you to a contract with a single rule. If at any time you do anything that I deem disloyal, you die. And if we refuse? You die. die? <laughs> Well, you got that cleared up. In that case, the killers and the thieves of Allegis Exploration Ship Number Four are at your service. Nelson. My name is Sachin, and I swore an oath: better to die free. Then why than did you help him? At the feet of false gods. Then why did you I help him? I will not kneel. It was kind of random because it didn't. Would, I swear he was helping Does this him. This man speak for all of you. Surely some here would prefer to live. One small genuflection and life goes on. One sanctum under me for the benefit of all. You stand by your principles and your people stand by you. Those are the qualities of a true leader. <laughs> How does he know how to use a gun? Wasn't Indra, have, didn't they like have to learn? There is I'm just saying. Sanctum. Kneel before him or die. Death is life. I still feel really weird about that because I swear that he was trying to help him. Oh my god, where's your beard? I have a moment. Oh my god, he looks so weird. Put the beard back. Look at him, Wayne. Lock him up with the others. Let's go. Move it. He looks baby faced now, it's so weird. You're wondering what will happen to your friends? Yes, my shepherd. Join me, please. You remind me of my son, Reese. He went in search of the flame, I never saw him again. I think my daughter killed him. I'll never know for sure. <laughs> well, yeah, because the, the show was never greenlit. Your daughter really is in there. You can find out. All right. If you can get it. And if we can repair it. And if it contains the code to the last war, your friends will be absolved. Raven, you were there. Who took it after it came out of math? I don't know. And if I did, I wouldn't tell you. <laughs> This one damn cat. Bellamy, no! Get off! Don't touch me! It's so much your family. Mm. Who the hell are you? The man you love. The man I love would not be okay with torturing Raven. It's not torture. Meanwhile, you went around and killed if a bunch of people it. just because. I know these people, Bellamy. I trained for five years to pass as one. And I spent another three months and I actually became one. Also, I could save you. And then avenge you. I'm sorry you went through that. Are you? Because it looks to me like while I was out there doing everything I could to get to you, you were forgetting me. Forgetting your friends, who your family is. I scarred my own face to remind myself of who I was and where I came from so I wouldn't lose myself while I let them play with my mind. You've lost yourself, Bellamy. This isn't you. I'm trying to save you. All of you. And what happens if you can't find the flame? Just gonna stand by and watch as they execute us? 
You know I don't want that. That's not what I asked. What do you do? If you believe in something with all your heart, the people you love think is crazy. I don't know. Don't let it become you. I suppose. Is this thing you believe in really that important? Is it more important than us? Yes. Yikes. The end of war. No more senseless death. We're killing. The shepherd can deliver us there at Echo. No, we cannot. All of us. For all mankind. I just don't know how he is been brainwashed I don't know because like is it brainwashed because like he saw some weird vision thing I don't know why he saw that or how he saw that like that kind of just leaves it kind of ambiguous as to what is real and what's not I don't know I, I don't like it parents don't love God not me you gonna even for medical but what a clear on crew and not a bush out of day isn't that right, Indra? Excuse me? Oh, you heard me. You heard everything. What about her daughter? Gaia. We believe she's in the woods with a group led by Clark Griffin. They're armed and extremely dangerous. Indra led a search party to find her. I was on it. There's no sign of them. I did see this. I seen this on in time and got a flame on him. Why do you have Maddie's book? We have a deal. I kneel to you, the child is spared. Well, that was before she went into hiding with my enemies. Are you my enemy, Indra? No. Tell me where she is. I don't know. Have Triku clean up this mess. <laughs> you, convict. Come. You can't place the order. That almost looked like um Bran. <laughs> Come out now. It's okay. Clothing and medical supplies. Jackson said don't change the grossest bandages. Prioritize the antibiotics. Highest fevers only, you understand? There's no food. We're working on that. I'm proud of you too. Uh what for? Like you're smiling? <laughs> Sorry, it's just you're not worried about yourself, and I find that incredibly sexy. <laughs> hmm. Behavior that greatly increases our risk of death is sexy. Oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> it's no castle. <laughs> no. no cave. Garage. With you all that are castles. Again? I don't think so. What was that? What do you got? Shade Hater slaughtered the children of Gabriel. They didn't kneel. All of them? Almost all. Hey, it's okay. Okay, I got you, kid. Come on. Come on. Shade Hater is looking for Maddie. If he finds her, he'll kill you, too. Yeah, trust me, I'm aware. Do you have any weapons? Nuclear reactor counts. I'm proud of you, Murphy. <laughs> yeah, get in line. Uh oh. Two people just said they were proud of him. What happened? If this episode ends the way that I think it's Take going to end now. Shower. Clean him up. Don't push him to talk. Yesterday he lost his biological parents, and today his people were killed. What can I do for him? Indra? No, but she said you could hide me. Did she now? Because I think Indra knows me better than that. Hiding people from a one-eyed mass murdering dictator, not really a survivor's move. He better's not inviting me in. Drop it. Should hate asked me to follow her. I'm so glad it led me here. Open the reactor door. I don't know the code. The first one goes in your leg. Fine. Easy, easy. Okay, okay, okay. Jackpot. <laughs> hey, 
how'd I look on camera? Oh, good. <laughs> she followed Indra? Oh, yeah. You know, I'm starting to miss being a live coward. It's about time. I have been racking my brain trying to figure out how you telling Cadigan the truth about the flame helps us. You know what I've come up with? It doesn't. I couldn't lie to him. Really? Why not? I had an experience. Something that changed me to my core. Something that explains why we're still here and where we're going. It I don't really need a flashback. It was Mom just was last episode. The shepherd led me to her. And there was a light that was beautiful and warm and peaceful. And I chose it. And when I opened my eyes, the storm had passed. Just like that. Bellamy. Clark, I did. I know how this sounds, but it's real. A war is coming. The last war we will ever fight. Win it. And we become the light. Is that what the cult leader told you? Did he tell you what happens if we lose? We won't. We turn into crystal. Wiped out. Like Medusa turning people into stone. It's the end of everything. Not everything. Just us. If I told you the AI that destroyed the Earth was storing our minds in a city of light, would that be any more believable? What about a group of astronauts turning themselves into gods by transferring their minds into the bodies of their own followers in order to live forever? Okay, yes, we've seen our share of crazy, but that doesn't change the fact that fighting some war to become the light is as ridiculous as the clothes you're wearing. It's one way to find out. Tell me where the flame is. See, why does what? she have such a gripe against him, though? Dozens of disciples are dead, including first disciple Anders. Yes, and every one of them has tried to keep us from saving our friends. And now I am trying to save you, all of you. Clark, if you don't tell me where it is, they will execute all of you. Please. Did we need this for Bellamy's character? Help. We've already had him, like, betray his friends before. Go float yourself. We've already done this with Pike. We've moved past this. Why is he doing it again? Why? Why are we doing this again? Guards, take this one to M Cap. What? Hey, wait, Bellamy. What are you doing? What I have to do. They all hate me. Mm. Maybe you shouldn't. Know. Do what you're doing. When we transcend, they will understand. For all mankind. For all mankind. Our guest is awake. Yeah. Now she snores worse than you do. Rude. Hey, it's okay. She can't hurt anyone. You know, I actually have been wondering about something. You think Hatch would have kneeled? I bet he would have. I think he probably would have even made you hate to think he was working for him. He wouldn't have actually done the work, though, would he? <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> See that patch over there? Hatch and I welded that into place. He already knew he was gonna die. All his men were down, and Raven, in one of her more questionable moments that I nevertheless respect, locked me in here with him. She didn't think he was gonna finish the job once he knew, but he did. You know why? To save you. That's what he said. Now, if you don't stop freaking out, we are gonna have to hold you in the core, where the radiation from the reactor that he helped keep from melting down will eventually kill you. The sacrifice will be worthless. Personally, I don't wanna see that happen to you. Good. Look, when this is all over, we'll drink to him in the tavern, okay? All right, I'm awesome. The Neuralink won't engage with me fighting like this. Keep trying. Clark, tell us where the flame is. Sir, she's dangerously close to hemorrhaging. I don't think she knows. She does. Or she wouldn't be fighting. Turn it off. I'm sorry, Bellamy, you did what you could. Send the first of her friends to penance. Wait. I'll take you to it. 
But only once all my friends are safe. Done. It didn't have to be like this. No, it didn't, but you decided to do this. Yes, it did. When you're done, clean yourself up. Festivities are about to begin. Yeah, for you. Oh my god. It's perfect. There's more Ada. Bring it in. Oh cool, there's like this circular thing that would fit it exactly. <laughs> okay. Uh never mind. Save the best for last. The convict you had follow Indra has gone missing. Fortunately, I took it upon myself to have that convict follow me. Oh. After the death wave, I didn't eat for more than two weeks. Death wave? A wave of radioactive fire. Can you survive that long on that food? The fire jumped our valley. The radiation didn't. Everyone I knew died. My parents. I was alone for 58 days. I still dream about it sometimes. But Clark helped me through it. Friends can be good at that, too. I wish I knew you as a kid. <laughs> How about we go back upstairs, finish what we started? <laughs> John! You think they have engine troubles? Stay here. No, I'm coming with you. You'll expect to see both of us. So we got in a fight. We went for a walk. Don't worry, I'll sell it. What if you don't? You'll be on the wrong side of the door. You'll be on the right side. I've got this. I feel like you might not. I'm coming back. Oh, no. Thank God you're back. I... You're not a Mori. May we come in? It's a little late. He knows. Yeah, I figured. <clears throat> Open it. The reactor? I like you, John. But our relationship's at a crossroads. Open that door and you and your freak drain that girlfriend live. I told you not to call her that. Hey, Cyclops. If anything happens to John, I blow the reactor. If you try to come in here, guess what? I blow the reactor. They're bluffing, Hada. Are they? Everyone in there knows that they're dead the second that door opens. Life that's called having nothing to lose. In chess, I believe that's called a uh, stalemate. Game's not over yet. Also, some of them will survive because they have uh, no blood. Stay here, wait them out. When the door opens, kill them all. We had a deal. Clark, what is this? What deal? He releases all of us, and I take him to the flame. You'll forgive me if I have trust issues where you're concerned. <laughs> Remove the restraints one at a time. Any violence will be met with lethal force. No one is getting violent. It's a good thing. You're being released. Helmet on to protect your memory. Good with this? Helmet on. Setting the fighters first, is that it? Can't be too careful. Let's go. Go ahead, step through. Next. Ensuring you keep your part of the deal. He didn't send them to Sanctum. Correct. And thank you for demonstrating why I didn't send you with them. You know how the stone works. Also correct. Where are they? They're safe. I promised they would be. I said nothing about releasing them on Sanctum. You know about this? He doesn't know where they are. Only I do. I told you. Clark. I don't trust you. I do, however, trust the love you have for your friends. And once I have the key in the 
last war begins, they'll all be freed. At which point, each of you will be welcome to fight alongside us. When the future is not too well, we'll save you anyway. That is what we mean when we say, for all mankind. We did send them back. So it's coming through. Not yes. Okay. What the hell happened here? Gee, where to begin? <laughs> hey, what's up you guys? Quick interruption here. Um, as you are no doubt aware, these past few years have been tough on all of us. Um, and there are some things that none of us can hide from. Um, the cost of living, for instance, Food and things like electricity, gas, and water have all gone up, and they continue to go up. Um, now, I don't really like to advertise this, but in order to afford keeping the lights on, the camera running, and to be able to provide you guys with new content, like this, very edit, for example, uh, I feel I need to let you guys know about how you can help support the channel and myself. I have a Patreon that if you pledge to, you're helping support the channel, and in return, you can get a vast amount of content that you wouldn't regularly get on YouTube, such as full unedited reactions to my regular content, a ton of other shows and movies that you probably don't even know that I've reacted to. A link to this can be found in the description below, and it really does help the channel by keeping me and my very cute cats alive. Think of the cats. If you're interested, you can also check out our website, which is also linked below. Perhaps there's some shows and movies there that you didn't even know that I reacted to, but you always wanted to see. Please know, pledging is entirely your own choice, of course. You're welcome to stay here on YouTube and wait for the edits to come out. No worries, I'm not going anywhere. More edits are coming. Uh, I understand not everyone is in the position to support creators, but any help is welcome. Anyways, thank you for your continued support, whether it's through YouTube or on Patreon. You guys are the best. Now please, enjoy the rest of the video. Alrighty, well that was The 100, Season 7, Episode 12. Um, I do we really need this from Bellamy? It's really frustrating. I feel like we've literally already done this with his character. He's already betrayed them and then like moved on from it. We don't need the same thing again. Oh my god, I was so worried for Murphy this episode. They like, they telegraphed that he was gonna die and then he didn't. And I'm feeling much better now, I think. Um... Yeah. Um, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you guys thought, and I'll see you in the next one. Uh -oh.